Numbers versus words, round one. 29 versus... To lick something into shape. So to lick something into shape is one of those expressions that wears its heart on its sleeve. And there are many of them in English. Um, and it's semi-literal, Tom, because uh, the belief persisted for centuries, right up mm. until Shakespeare's time, that bear cubs are born as formless furry blobs and they have to be licked into bear shape by their mums. Isn't that gorgeous? <laughs> yeah. Does it look like a bear when a baby bear It, does. Was it born? looks very much like a bear. Okay. And it doesn't, I mean, I'm sure it's licked, but it doesn't need to be licked into shape. But I just think it's such a beautiful demonstration of maternal love. It gives me goosebumps every time. And it's still used in that context? Uh, no, nowadays you just tell your teenager to lick their room into shape. I think it sounds like a military boot camp type thing. Um, but no, it's born in that belief. And I'll throw in one extra for you. Swan Song was born in another belief, which is that swans are born mute and they remain mute all their lives until the moment before their death when they burst into beautiful song. Isn't that gorgeous? 29 is what is called a sexy prime, Ooh. which is an excellent name. I didn't know they <laughs> Neither did I. <laughs> so a, a sexy prime is a prime number, first and foremost. So a prime number is any number uh, where it's only two factors are itself and one. Mm -hmm. So the only way to make 29 is one times 29. Yeah. Therefore it's prime. And a sexy prime is <laughs> any prime number that is exactly six away from another prime number. It's a sexy prime, not a sexy prime. It's sexy, okay, but it's six away. So okay. it's based on the the Latin sex. Sex. Yes. 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 So okay. It, it is linked to six. Yes. I remember that a um, another word for a um, oh god, what's a six sided figure? Hexagon. Yes. <laughs> um, I remember reading in the Oxford English Dictionary that another word for the hexagon was a sex angle which just made me go. laugh, yeah. but now I get it. Yeah. So I, I don't know how attractive these numbers are, but they are, <laughs> <laughs> but they are definitely six away from other prime numbers. So 29 is six away from 23. Okay. So of course, if you go the other way, you would get 35, which is five times seven. And oh. the reason I picked 29 specifically as a sexy prime is it's part of the longest sequence of successive sexy primes. So you have 29 and then 23 is also a sexy prime because take away 6 you get 17, also prime. Take away 6 you get 11, also prime. Take away 6 you get 5, oh, also prime. Love it. So it's the longest sequence of sexy primes, which is why I picked 29. So you get to choose which is the sexiest. Is it 29 or is it to lick something into shape? Tell us in the comments and we will be posting the results before long.